All right, so here's how we can have someone on Zoom, like a stage manager, control QLab all remotely through the chat on Zoom. So um, the three features for this is a go queue, a go to queue, and a panic. And not only can we control QLab from Zoom, but we can send messages back for standby queues and what queue is triggered. Let's just go to Q1. And there's two ways. We can either do capital G, go to Q space one, and then the minute we hit enter, we will trigger Q1. And you will also notice Q1 is triggered. Um, let's go to the next Q. Um, and a go is either G, capital G, or semicolon, because it's right next to the enter button. So that right there, hit enter, a go is triggered. And you'll notice Q2 triggered, standing by Q3. Um, let's hit go again, but this time with the G, enter. That'll go. Let's do that again but let's also do our panic queue. So go to queue, I believe that was three. And um, I'm gonna real quick do exclamation point enter to panic out. So enter, exclamation point, and we panicked out. And how we know is that it'll send us back Panic in QLab was triggered from this. All right, so basically how to get this all started is on your stage manager computer, the remote computer, all they would need to do is rename themselves SM or make sure that you rename them SM. And that's all they need to do. And they are set up and good to go. But on the show computer, the three things you need is QLab version 4.6.6, I believe. Um, Cause if you're a version before that, the go to queue might not work. Uh, from experience. Um, you need a code editor, something like VS Code is what I'm using, or Terminal you can use this in. And then the last thing you'll need is Zoom OSC on this computer to get all the chat into Node.js. So um, how, how to get this all working is in VS Code, what you can do is after you clone the repository, what you're gonna wanna do is npm install or sudo npm install, and that will take all the dependencies from package.json, which all that is in here is osc-min to get your node modules in your file. So it will not come with node modules, so you'll have to install that like that. And then after you install, all you have to do is npm start. So everything is started and it'll log um, where all the OSC is coming in on and sending out to. And um, another thing to mention is um, just because the stage manager is getting all these cues, no one else is. That is because it is specifically sending only to someone named SM. So it's receiving to someone named SM and sending back to the person named SM. So if you had any other person in Zoom named something else, it won't send to them. And then even for kind of a fail safe for uh, the stage manager. So like, let's say even if I hit G O, nothing's gonna nothing's gonna um, trigger in QLab. It's listening only for exactly a G or a capital G or the semicolon. If the semicolon is just included in it, it won't work. It has to be exactly what it is. Um, but yeah, there it is, guys. Zoom OSC QLab chat control.